Chinese dramas have plenty of young and extremely brilliant actresses. In this video I will reveal my personal top 10 most talented female stars born after 2000. Born on October 11, 2001, Shin Yu Jie is already rising quickly through the industry despite debuting in 2022. International fans may recognize her as the charming niece to Dylan Wong's character in Only for Love, which is one of the most popular dramas that aired in 2023. Her performance was great in the show, despite it being only her second role as an actress. Not to mention that she also had plenty of chemistry with Miles Wei, who plays the love interest. She also starred alongside Zhao Yiqin in the new costume drama, Hard to Find. With her impressive beauty and acting, Shin Yu Jie's future as a C-drama actress is looking very bright. Deng Enqi, otherwise known as Ansi Deng, was born on April 18, 2005. As a teenager, she was part of the main cast of Legend of Awakening, a costume drama that also stars Arthur Chen and Ching Shao. Moreover, she was the main lead, along with Zhang Linghe, in the popular 2021 high school drama, Flourish in Time. Despite being so young, she has already appeared as the lead actress in multiple television series. Not to mention she also has a major historical drama coming up, which will also co-star Ryan Ding. Despite having a very busy career so far, it seems like Deng Enqi is just getting started. You should expect to see a lot more of her in the future. Sun Jini, born on May 5, 2000, initially started her career in the entertainment industry as part of the SNH48 girl group, before transitioning into acting. You may best know her from Till the End of the Moon, a popular Xianxia drama that first aired in 2023. Despite the limited screen time as the third female lead, she was able to command attention every time she appeared, thanks to her alluring charisma. After her breakthrough performance, Sun Jini was casted as the main lead in an upcoming Xianxia drama, co-starring alongside Zhang Binbin. You should also expect her to star in many other high-profile projects in the future as she continues to build her momentum. Born on May 20, 2000, Liu Houtsman mostly acted in movies since debuting in the industry in 2020. She starred with Jackson Yi in 2020's A Little Red Flower, as well as Song Wei Long in 2023's Just For Meeting You. Also in 2023, drama fans finally saw her impressive acting talent on display in Derailment. In this show, she plays a rich heiress that somehow ended up in a parallel world where she was just an ordinary working-class girl. She will also be reuniting with Song Wei Long in an upcoming sci-fi drama. While Liu Haotsuan just arrived in the C-drama scene, she is quickly establishing herself as one of the top young actresses. Born on April 22, 2000, Li Gengxi has already built up quite a resume despite still being very young. Foreign fans should best know her as one of the main leads in Sword Snow Stride, which also co-starred Zhang Ruoyun. Showing off her acting range, she would later play as a high school student struggling to pass the college entrance exam in 2022's The Examination for Everyone. She also delivered a masterful performance in 2023's The Long Season, which ended up being the highest-rated Chinese television shows for that year. Despite being deemed as not being traditionally attractive by Chinese viewers, Li Gengxi's acting abilities have carried her to a great career so far, and it should get even better in the future. Zhuang Defei, or Sabrina Zhuang, was born on February 28, 2001. She made her official debut in the industry in 2018, and then got her first leading role in 2019, with Mountains and Ocean. Her best work so far is I Don't Want to Be Friends With You, a drama where her character travels back to the past, so that she can change the fate of her mother. She is also starring in the upcoming movie version, Be My Friend. In the immediate future, she will appear in My Wife's Double Life television show, in addition to pairing up with Xiao Zhan in The Legend of the Condor Heroes The Great Hero Movie. As you can see, Zhuang Defei has plenty of compelling series to watch from the past, as well as plenty of exciting future projects. Xiang Hanji, or Julia Xiang, was born on May 4, 2002. Despite still being young, she has already starred in several popular shows, including Forever Love with Wang and Yu, which ended up being a big hit internationally. She also co-starred with Yang Suwen in the time-traveling romance, Love in Time. 
Not to mention she was great in Ripe Town, one of the highest rated dramas of 2023. In her immediate future, she has her first main lead role in the costume drama, Love of the Divine Tree, with the popular Deng Wei playing her love interest. With a mix of idol and non-idol dramas, Xiang Han Ji should end up being one of the most popular actresses in her age group. Despite her mature looks, Wang Yinglu was actually born on August 19, 2000. While she entered the acting scene in 2020, it wasn't until 2023 that she broke out. I Am Nobody is a modern-day wuxia where she plays the strange, but ultimately lovable from Bao Bao. She showed amazing athleticism to go along with impeccable humor timing. I Am Nobody became a surprise hit, and is getting a second season where Wang Yinglu is expected to return. Not to mention she is also the main female lead in a costume wuxia drama, as she will pair up with Arthur Chen, who was also born in 2000. With her classical beauty and dedication to acting, Wang Yinglu has plenty of momentum that should carry her to superstardom. Zhang Zifeng, or Wendy Zhang, was born on August 27, 2001. She started in the industry as a child, debuting in 2010. On the movie side, she starred in Go Brother with Zhao Jin Mai and Peng Yu Chang, upcoming summer with Wu Lei, as well as I Love You to the Moon and Back with Hu Xian Su. When it comes to television dramas, she is best known for Boyhood and The Heart of Genius. Not to mention she is also set to star in Loving Strangers, a remake to the Korean drama called My Mister. Her co-star there is Mark Chow, or Zhao Yu Ting, one of the biggest names in the Chinese entertainment industry. Jumping between movies and dramas, Zhang Zifeng should continue to be a dominant force among her peers. Zhao Jin Mai, or Angel Zhao, was born on September 29, 2002. Like Zhang Zifeng, she started out very early in the entertainment industry as a child actress in 2012. As I mentioned before, she co-starred with Zhang Zifeng and Peng Yu Chang in Go Brother, in addition to playing the main role in One Week Friends, which also starred Lin Yi, Xin Yu, and Wang Jiahui. On the small screen, foreign fans should best know her for starring in a little thing called First Love with Lai Quan Lin, reset with Bai Jing Ting and amidst a snowstorm of love with Wu Lei. She is also the main lead in the upcoming historical drama, The Princess Royal, with Zhang Linghe. Zhao Jin Mai has the perfect combination of beauty and talent to remain at the top of her age group for many years to come. Feel free to share your thoughts on my rankings for these C-drama actresses born after 2000 in the comments section. If I left someone off, then you can mention her below as well. If you enjoy this top 10 video, then I would be eternally grateful if you can click like and subscribe. If you are a fan of the aforementioned Amidst a Snowstorm of Love, then you can check out my recommendations video for a list of dramas to watch next.